Hey everybody, it's Ryan from Level Up Tactical and I'm here today to talk to you guys a little bit about um, equipment, essentially holsters, affordable holsters, uh, and mag carriers. So over the past year, there have been uh, a lot of new firearms owners, uh, especially with COVID and all the uh, various things that have been going on in the country. Um, people have taken uh, to firearms. They've purchased new firearms and uh, there's a lot of questions as to uh, what gear is good for them uh, as far as holsters, mag carriers, that type, uh, you know, home safes, which is a whole other video. Uh, so I figured I'd do a quick video here and talk about some affordable options for um, holsters and mag carriers that I've come across and that uh, we've recommended to our students uh, who take our practical shooting course and have been very happy with them. Um, the company that we're going to talk about today is a company called Cytac, C-Y-T-A-C. Now they are an offshore company uh, who makes OEM product for various um, manufacturers, both overseas and stateside. Um, essentially, they uh, make a polymer uh, holster mag carrier uh, that, uh, for almost for almost every type of uh, pistol out there, um, uh, they even have a universal uh, holster, which uh, it goes beyond what most people think. But essentially. Uh, if they don't have a holster for you yet, which they're adding new uh, new brand, new lines all the time, um, you could essentially slide your firearm into this universal holster, clamp it down so it conforms, the inner sheath, inner sheath conforms to your firearm, um, and then you lock it in. Uh, and then it, it actually even has retention. Um, so uh, it's a nice affordable option. We do have use a couple of those on our uh, training days for people that come that either forgot their holster or they weren't able to find a holster in time. Uh, and it's worked out very well for us. Um, one of our clients had a, 19, a SIG 1911 with a rail, and apparently that's very hard to find holsters for. Uh, he was able to use one of our universal holsters uh, and eventually ended up picking up one of his own. And uh, it worked out great for him for the class. He actually loves it. He's keeping his um, as kind of a backup or a loner in case somebody else goes to the range with him uh, now that he was able to find a, an actual holster for his 1911. Uh, so anyway, so the company, again, is named Cytac. Uh, again, they are an offshore company. They do make OEM uh, product for various manufacturers, both overseas and domestically here in the U.S., uh, and a, a polymer holster. Um, this is uh, the holster, one of the holsters. Uh, this is actually the holster for the SIG P365 and 365XL. Uh, it does have uh, retention here. Uh, you can see from the video here that it is polymer. Um, it's very well constructed. It does have angle. You can adjust the angle like almost any other, um, you know, holster out there. Uh, there's an Allen key in the inside here that you basically adjust, and you can adjust for the cant however you like. Uh, and there is uh, you may not be able to see it very well, but see this this pad here. This is a grippy, so it it does the slide on your body, uh, and like some other inexpensive holsters will do. Now this holster. Um, uh, again, for the P SIG P365 and 365XL, is under $30. I think this was um, $23 on Amazon, believe it or not. There'll be a link below if anybody's interested in this. Uh, and let me show you here. I have a P365XL. Let me show you that it is clear. There's nothing in the chamber. No magazine. So, um, it is nice. And it, you know, it slides in. You hear a positive lock there. And it doesn't fall out. Uh, if you want to draw, basically you push the you push the retention button in and draw. Okay, so it's a very nice holster. Um, I've actually used this holster in the promo video that I shot for uh, our firearms training course. Uh, it, it was it was nice. I had never used a holster with retention before, so it did take a little bit of getting used to to, to push the button and draw. Um, but it was once I you know got into that habit, your finger lands there anyway when you want to draw. So you push you know a little positive pressure and you pull it right out. Um, these holsters are very very durable. Um, they uh, I've dropped them, I've kicked them, I've stepped stepped on them, walked over them by accident on the range. Um, I've had students slip and fall, thankfully with no firearm in them. Uh, but they did land on them. They didn't break. They didn't shatter. They didn't crack. They didn't. They're very, very durable. For the money, I don't think you could find a better holster out there. Um, this is a SIG holster from uh, a P250, uh, 360, or a P250 and a P365. 
320 compact and full size. This was the holster that they used to sell, uh, actually used to come with the uh, Nitron series. Um, and I have a SIG X carry over here. Again, showing you, it is clear, nothing in the chamber, no mag. Um, so this will fit in here. And it does have positive lock, but if you shake it hard enough, it will eventually fall out unless you tighten it down super tight. Um, now this holster is not um, is not uh, as well built, in my opinion, as the SciTech. You could feel that the polymer flexes a little bit more. Uh, it doesn't seem as uh, as nice. Okay, um, let me put this down here for a second. Now. When you get these holsters from SciTech, regardless of where you buy them, they're, they're mostly an internet company. Uh, there are some brick and mortar locations that are starting to carry these now, which is really nice because these are a great, great holster option for somebody just starting out or even if somebody's looking for a holster for their uh, for their side when they go out hunting and they want to cross draw, hip carry, whatever it may be. This is a great, great option. Uh, they come packaged like this. Uh, the packaging, the original packaging was a little bit different. It was actually white, but now they have this orange, bright orange packaging. Um, this is the R Defender series. Um, and uh, you are able to carry in, you know, different cans and all that other stuff. It's nice because, uh, you know, they think of everything. Who wants to, who wants to sit there and fumble with packaging, right? So, basically, you have a zip top, uh, a uh, zip lock type top opening. Okay. So the the packaging's nice. It comes with, uh, you know, various. Uh, they do have various options uh, for. Uh, holsters. They have inside the waistband, outside the waistband. They have uh, retention, no retention, level three retention. The whole nine yards. It comes with an Allen key to help you adjust the cant uh, down the road. But um, again, you can see here the differences between the stock SIG holster and the SciTac. Uh, obviously, this has retention. Uh, it's it's designed a little bit differently. It's a little bit bulkier, uh, but when you have it on the body, it actually is very comfortable. You barely even know it's there. Um, the grip is phenomenal. Uh, this thing great if you put it on your side once you position it on your body and tighten your belt down this thing does not move uh, It's great. Uh, and again, you can adjust the cant on the inside um, And you can like I said you could you know, they're they're fairly uh, fairly You know similar to a certain extent, but this one seems like it's built a little bit better the, the polymer uh, that it's made of is a little thicker It feels more sturdy in the hand uh, This one kind of feels like a toy like this is definitely you know, this was a free holster um this one feels much more expensive than it is. Um, and again, I will lock this back here. Again, you guys know this is already clear and safe. Now this is again out of the packaging, so I haven't adjusted retention or anything, but you can see that in there, this ain't going anywhere. Uh, and this is a heavy pistol. Again, press the retention button, slide it right out. You're good to go. Positive lock, you hear it snap into place. And you know, I'm pulling this thing and it's not coming out. As soon as I hit the button, it's coming out. Uh, it's a nice holster. Um, I definitely would recommend this to somebody if they're interested in, in one of these. Um, the uh, the uh, the price point is unbelievable. I mean, at twenty eight twenty between twenty three and twenty eight dollars, uh, depending on which version you get or which model firearm you're trying to get for, uh, it's it's great. You can't beat it. Um, they also offer, which I haven't taken out of the packaging yet, but they have this. Um, this clamp for the belt that basically replaces um, it replace you take the paddle off and you can put this on so it's more of a permanent fixture on your belt it does clamp into place if you're using a shooting belt or a duty belt this is also polymer uh, you, it is a quick release so you can once you have it on your belt if you wanted to take it off your belt you just hit those two little buttons you slide it off it does have retention and it does offer adjustments for cant as well uh, so let me put that back in here before I lose it. It does come with a screw, uh, Allen key, and a uh, lock, lockdown screw in case you lose it when you take it off the holster. Um, so it is, it's is—it's a very nice product. Uh, again, the company SciTac. Uh, you can easily find them on Amazon uh, if you look on there. Okay. Uh, they also offer, I did mention before, they offer mag carriers, um, which is nice. So uh, this these are the mag carriers that I have been using uh, for loaners. Uh, they are the SIG TAC holsters. Um, they're made in Israel. Uh, you've seen these everywhere. You've seen them on Amazon. I, I think even Blackhawk makes these. 
uh, makes similar versions to these. I think almost every other company out there does. Now, I've, I've used them for various pistols, uh, so, and every time I do it, I gotta tighten you know, screws down. Uh, these, obviously, uh, I was carrying uh, P320 mags in this one, so they are not, um, they are not locked down for these. These are 365 XL mags. Uh, so you can see, obviously, they slide right out. But if I was to screw them down, they would hold in there pretty tight. Uh, but not all, not a ton of uh, adjustability. You have one screw there. Okay, uh, you can adjust for cant on this as well. Again, no grippy surface back. But this is um, considered a budget mag carrier. Uh, and for what it does, and for what most people use it for, this does work great. Um, SciTech, however, makes one, again, budget mag carrier. I think this is $22, uh, between $18 and $22, depending on which uh, Amazon retailer is selling it. Um, it has the same grippy surface back, so it won't slide around on your body. Uh, again, with this one, you know, this slides left and right. This one, it grips. It doesn't move. Uh, well, you know, if you push it, it'll move. But um, retention is very nice. You have three points of adjustment. You have one here, one in the middle, and one to the right. Uh, this way you can get a general retention here, but sometimes different mags, they bend, they shift. Uh, you might need to make one a little bit tighter than the other. Um, and the mag, the, you know, the mags have a nice positive feel. When you push it in, you feel a little click in there. Um, it's nice. Um, there's also what I like a lot about this versus uh, the budget made in Israel ones. If you notice, I don't know if you can see it here, uh, inside this crevice here, there's nothing but an O-ring for retention or for, for negative pressure, I guess. Um, the Cytax have, if you could see it, let me see if I can get the light in there. They have uh, springs in there so that when you, you can kind of see when I squeeze it down, there, there's springs in there. So it pushes out a little bit. It gives a little bit of uh, negative force in there and it's nice. Um, like I said, you can adjust on the fly. With these mag carriers, you need a hex key or Allen key to do it. Uh, once you get the general tension correct on the side tax, you can actually finger tighten or loosen uh, these outside adjustments here for that fine tuning, which is really nice because sometimes you sw slip the mags in and out, you might need to tighten or loosen and you don't want to run back to the table and pick up a Allen key. Uh, so again, uh, and the construction, like I said, the polymer's thicker, uh, feels thicker anyway, feels more sturdy on the SciTech uh, carriers versus the uh, the original uh, SIG or Israeli made um, car mag carriers. Now both will work fine. Both are roughly around the same price, but for the for the money, like I said, you can't go wrong with the SciTech. It just seems like it's built better. Um, they also make, for those of you who uh, are into three gun or maybe uh, do some home defense training or, or uh, MSR training, um, they make a M, uh, I'm sorry, an AR-15 or MSR mag carrier uh, as well. Uh, they sell a single and a double. This is the single, obviously. Uh, I have not used this yet. It is very tight. I haven't adjusted tension or anything for it, but you can see this is a hex, uh, a hex mag, and you can see that it fits in there very nicely. It's very snug. This is probably a little bit too snug. I had to loosen this one up a little bit, but uh, it's made of the same materials. It has all the same materials as the uh, pistol, holsters and the mag there's pistol mag carriers the uh grippy grippiness on the back is not the same um if you see here this is they got that nice gray this is actually black it does have the, the grip um it's there and the great thing about this is you can actually and i've never done it and again forgive me um let me see here you can yes so you can adjust it you can take this off and um have it attached to your belt through the, the belt clamp that I showed you earlier. There are, are modular attachments for this type of thing. I think Blackhawk has a modular system where it sits on a nub and it slides into the carrier. This is very similar. They do have an attachment for that uh, Blackhawk style attachment. I forget what it's called, um, but uh, it's, I think they call it, I don't remember what they call it, but anyway, you guys know what I'm talking about. You can adjust that here, put that on here, and I believe uh, if you use the other clip, you can have you can adjust for cant. Uh, you can adjust for cant on this as well. Uh, so if you're carrying it a little bit further in your back, you can have it adjusted so that the mags are pointed up a little or toward your, towards your front a little bit more. Uh, again, these screws they do have a spring in there. You can't see it quite this very second because I have the way I have this set up and I haven't finished setting this up yet, but. Uh, it's great. It's a great solid mag carrier. I mean, I, I you really just can't go wrong with this product. Um, you know, if you like, I said, if you're setting up uh, a, a gun belt for uh, training or competition, uh, maybe you're just getting started out and you don't want to spend uh, 
hundreds of dollars on a, a holster setup or a belt setup, this might be a great way to go. Uh, you know, just for, for argument's sake, say, you know, you're shooting a three, 320, uh, this holster is about $28, um, mag carrier, $18, uh, AR mag carrier, MSR mag carrier, another $18 to $20 each, uh, you know, you, you can't go wrong. I mean, you're, for, for under what you would probably spend for a, a much higher dollar holster, you're getting all three pieces just to get you started. And then uh, if you decided that you wanted to, um, you know, graduate up to a, a, a higher level piece of equipment, uh, this stuff you probably will hang on to because you can use it as loaner, backup gear, uh, you never know. Uh, for those people that like to open carry, uh, again, the uh, holster itself is very nice because it does have retention so someone's not going to just walk up to you, grab your pistol and try to yank it and use it. They have to know to press the button, which most people won't do. Uh, if they're trying to just grab your stuff. Um, they do have a thumb retention holster, more of a, a law enforcement style, uh, where you have to thumb press uh, before you pull. Um, so they have that as well. Um, they have, like I mentioned before, they have a number of different um, types of holsters that they offer. Inside the waistband, made of the same polymer material, and it has the claw. They have inside the waistband um, uh, mag carriers. They have a drop leg attachment. They have that modular system, which I don't have one here to show you. Um, essentially, it's, it's, it's essentially the same exact set setup as the Black Hawk holsters where uh, you hit the button, you twist and pull it out and you can drop it and twist it, and put it back onto another, you know, go from a leg rig to a chest rig to a hip rig or into your car. They have the same thing. Um, and price points are all roughly around the same. They're all between you know, 18 and $30. Um, so like in certain, in certain instances, I'm um, looking right here, there's one for um, the universal ones, like $32, but everything else I'm looking at here is like $20, $25, uh, $14. Uh, you, again, you just can't go wrong. The inside the waistband uh, for the P365 XL and the 365 is $21. Uh, and it has the retention claw, so it sits a little closer on your body. Um, you know, you, you really just can't go wrong with this product. I can't say uh, anything more that's good about it outside of, uh, you know, you really need to get your hands on one uh, to try. Uh, and Amazon's great. You know, you get it, you try it out, you don't like it, you can always send it back, get your money back. But I'm going to probably say that 98% of you are not going to be sending these back. Now, keep in mind, these are not, um, these are not, uh, What's the best way to put it? These are not those high dollar uh, type holsters, okay? These are duty style holst holsters. Uh, these are the same product that they use uh, or sell to military and law enforcement, both uh, in domestically and overseas. Um, they may brand them differently uh, based on uh, what, you know, what the uh, needs are for that particular uh, company or the, the customer at the time. Uh, the name Cytac is their retail brand. So it's the same product, just a different brand on here, okay? Different mold, I guess you would say, uh, on here. Uh, you guys just got to check them out. Um, like I say, just go to Amazon. I'll have a link below uh, to the Cytac store on Amazon where you can uh, take a look at all the offerings they have there, both paddle, non-paddle. Uh, they, they have an ankle holster, chest, uh, shoulder holster. They have mo uh, molly clips that you can set this up on, on if you're using a tack vest. Um, it, it's just it's just a phenomenal product, and I can't say much more good about it. And just so everybody's aware, this is not a paid advertisement video for them. I did not get anything for free from them. These were purchased all directly here uh, from Amazon and from a local retailer uh, who was recently set up with them as a SciTech dealer. So... This is actual usage uh, review. This is not a, you know, they gave me some free products, so it's got to be the best thing in the world for you to buy. Spend $20, $25, try it out. This is going to be a phenomenal holster for you uh, for, uh, you know, some training. Um, again, if you're going to try to hold this up to a, uh, you know, like a, I'm trying to think here. Um, one of the, what's that? Whoever makes the holsters for SIG. They make those Kydex holsters. Um, this is not, you can't compare that to this, okay? This is, again, this is your entry to mid-level holster 
that'll function for anybody who's looking to uh, either open carry, carry while they're hunting, use for training um, as a backup pistol in the in the vehicle if they want to mount it somewhere or a holster. You know, just say you're wearing it uh, inside the waistband and you want to get in the car, you can unholster and have this mounted with that other bracket under your dashboard so you can click it there. Uh, you know, as long as it's legal within your state and wherever you're traveling, you can definitely do that. Uh, but this is a great product. Again, the company's name is Cytac. Here's another one of their mag holsters, uh, carriers in a packaging. Uh, Cytac, um, and their slogans, this defense for every second. And again, with this product, uh, I think everybody's gonna be very happy with it. Guys, don't forget to check out our other videos. If you like this uh, quick review, uh, you know, hit the like button, make sure you hit subscribe, check us out on social media. Uh, all of our links are below. Uh, we'll be shooting, uh, shooting some more videos on product reviews and uh, some more training videos. We have a defensive pistol class coming up. We have an entry level class coming up. We have a practical one and two coming up this summer. It's going to be a great uh, year. We're going to have lots of stuff, uh, content for you guys. Hope to see you guys soon. Stay safe and shoot straight.